uh, Empower Horror is a platform where we can know initially about ourselves, about myself, what are my attributes, what are my values, and what are my strengths, weakness, because it's very important initially to know about your mind skills, uh, what you have got. And after learning all those things together, you know, after learning all those things, it's very important to transform those skills in yourself. And my experience in Power Horror has, uh, has been the most uh, beautiful and most learning experience. In fact, um, I can actually I am actually transforming all those uh, skills that I have learning from each and every sessions, like uh, mentoring sessions, uh, entrepreneur skills. Um, after Empower Her, uh, I can actually feel those uh, differences in me and uh, I am actually implementing all the differences, all the transformation that I have learned, uh, learned in the different sessions conducted in the Empower Her session. Perception of uh, being the things have been changed, you know, and I'm I'm getting I, I'm actually implementing all those things uh, into my organization that is the cosmic technology as well. Uh, for example, in case of this is a decision making, I'm getting more friend. My uh, friends used to tell me that uh, my decisions are being much more uh, reliable and smarter than I used to take the decisions before in the so, Empower her actually brought a lot of changes in me, positiveness and uh, the way I tackle with the things around, um, more comfortable with the people. And my impact project is uh, calls and technology, that is uh, an idea and um, and also it's an organization that we are we are using. I'm associated with the organization since five months ago. Um, the impact project Girls in Technology is all about making the girls aware about the technology because what I find in my last uh, three to four years is we have really very few uh, women who study technology. Uh, there is a huge gender gap and why is so much gender gap in technology? I, I research about it and um, when I uh, went to our resource, uh, what I found was uh, those, those uh, root causes are from the very beginning, like from the schools, that starts from the primary, secondary or high schools. We are losing the girls in the STEM background, that is uh, science, mathematics, technology and engineering from the very, uh, uh, very beginning, very beginning. And when the uh, source is very narrow, by the end of high school, uh, we have a very few uh, women or girls, that is around uh, 14, 11 to 14 percent, and this is a very few percentage. And when the source is very few, how can we expect that the uh, branch uh, will be wider and it will go green? So, that is why I have chosen the project called uh, Girls in Technology, where I will be wearing the girls about the um, technology and training them with the programming classes and yes of course recruitment as well and those girls will those friend girls will be helping the next uh, generation girls as well to encourage and uh, bring them into technology together. I think I am equally uh, competitive for the project service project impact project. I'm a very dedicated person and I am really fascinated about changing the status quo that is existing in the technology field. We really have a very few uh, women tech leaders and women in technology. Um, if I, um, I think I have the passion to drive the women into the technology and I have been doing it as well um, as much as possible. I'm um, a very self-motivating person. Perception, the mentality that is growing in our society, and I'm truly against this. I want to upgrade the life of the women because technology and engineering subject uh, field has lots of uh, dynamicity and feasibility. And at the same time, the growth, the growth uh, financially is also very um, 
uh, exponential. So I want to change this, uh, change and upgrade the status of the women in the urban initially. Starting with urban, I will go with the, if possible, I also continue on in the rural as well. I like to go with urban is because uh, we have lots of uh, technology available in the urban and lots of girls know about it. So I want to wear them, train them uh, and bring them in the same group so that the rest of the next generation girls can, uh, can just see the role models and follow them uh, and I should really win. I think I should win because my idea can help the women digitally empowered, uh, empowered and uh, strong, make them strong.